Welcome back to the spotlight. Again, I want to thank Joel Ludeman for coming in and uh, playing our Santa Claus for us. And of course, Adam Bullis and Joel Cochran with a special guest appearance. <laughs> thank you guys and uh, you know, enjoy your uh, sports line and all those sports and everything that you guys do for the city of Warren. And uh, again, thanks for being on the show. But right now, to make sure your holiday is filled with holiday spirit, we toss things over for Becca for the word. What do you got for us, Becca? All right, thanks, Nick. Hi, guys. I'm Becca, and here's the word. If you need some help getting into the Christmas spirit, December 17th at the Redford Theater, they are having two showings of the classic Christmas movie, It's a Wonderful Life, with James Stewart. The movie is playing at 2 and 8 and only costs $4. Plus, you can take a picture with Santa when you're there. For more information or for a list of other upcoming classic movies playing there, visit redfordtheater.com. Now, going on now through December 23rd is the Detroit Artist Market annual art show for the hol holiday show. The gallery turns into a gift shop that features all handmade items by local artists. The gallery is open Tuesday through Sunday with varied hours. So if you're looking for something unique to give this holiday, make sure to check it out and visit their website at DetroitArtistMarket.org for more info. Also going on now until December 31st is the Wayne County Light Fest. It is the Midwest's largest drive through light display, featuring more than 45 animated displays. The show runs along Heinz Drive starting in Westland going through to Dearborn Heights. It opens each night at 7 and closes at 10. The cost is $5 per car. For more information, call 734-261-1990. Now, if you're not done with all your holiday shopping yet, there are a few local places here in Warren that you should check out. Coonan's Brewing Company will be releasing beer and bottles December 21st to 22nd, and they also have gift cards available. Champagne's Wine Cellar has all sorts of holiday handmade gift baskets with beer, wine, local chocolates, gourmet foods, and cheese. And of course, you can't forget to stop by Burler's Variety Store. They have every random thing you might possibly need, and it's always at a great price. Now, whether you're having your own or going out, there are a ton of New Year's Eve parties going on in the area. A few of them are at the Ritz in Warren's New Year's Eve Retox, featuring more than six bands, food, and a toast at midnight. The Fox Theater has New Edition playing for the first time since 1996 with the six original members, including Bobby Brown. And the Royal Oak Music Theater has their countdown party with bands and DJs, a champagne toast, and a balloon drop at midnight. Well, that's the word for now. Back to you, Nick. Thank you very much, Becca. You did a lovely <laughs> job as usual. Well, thank you, Now, Nick. did you have anything that you have, uh, maybe some traditions that you guys do around the holidays? Not really. I just always go home again and see how my family and my sister is coming back from Mexico. So very I'm excited. cool. Yeah. <laughs> Say, thanks, Suze. Thanks for watching. She always watches. Oh, yeah, right now. she does. <laughs> all the way to Mexico. <laughs> That's right. All the way to Mexico. Spotlight. All the way to Mexico. Yep. Awesome. <laughs> well, speaking of awesome... And, yes. of course, keeping in the tradition with holiday spirit, we had an awesome musical performance. Ladies and gentlemen, Frank McGlynn and Drummer Dave <laughs> with Jingle Bell Rock. Take 
take a look around the clock. A mix and a mingle and a jingle and beat. That's the jingle bell. That's the jingle bell. That's the jingle bell rock. Again, that was Frank McGlynn and Drummer Dave playing Jingle Bell Rock. And this guy plays in dueling piano bars all over the world. He's been in Amsterdam. Denver, and right now he's currently in Las Vegas. Yep, and he just moved back to Michigan, and he'll be playing at 526 Main, which is also known as Tequila Blue in Royal Oak from January 18th to 21st, if you want to see him there. And if you want any more information on Frank McGlynn or anything else you've seen on the show this week, I'm sorry, this month, <laughs> <laughs> visit us at facebook.com slash tvwarren.thespotlight. And uh, that's it. Yep. Uh, have a great Merry Christmas. Yeah. Happy holidays, happy new year. We will see, see you, you next year. <laughs> exactly. We will see you in 2012. But until then, it is lights out. Take care.